Hello, Mammoners, welcome back. I am Pothos, and welcome back to Sailwind. Lovely, lovely Sailwind. And today, we're going to do something a little bit special. We're going to play around with sails. The Shimmer Tower needs a new look. So we're going to have to bring the Shimmer Tower around into this dry dock. I think, I mean, we could try sailing it round, but I think just using the ropes and pulling it round will be the, the best thing to do. Let's see how that works. Oh, there's a... <laughs> The developers changed it, so you got, you've only got a certain amount of uh, length on the ropes now. Okay. Sneaky. Sneaky dev updates. Move this around then. To fair, we only need one, so they grab hold of you. Into there. What, what am I getting stuck on? Oh, maybe I'm just getting stuck on the invisible wall or something. Yeah, there's actually an invisible wall here, so I think there isn't a maximum length of the ropes. I think you can pull it infinitely long. It's just that uh, I hit the wall. We may have to sail it over. I don't know how we're going to do it otherwise. Let's sail him around. Right, let's jump on the shimmer towel. Pull you in tight. No, pull you in tight. Oh, cripes. What's happening? Uh oh. Oh, dear. I don't know what I did there. I got really confused with which ones were... <laughs> with which ones were which. But that's okay. Right. Into the dry dock. Grab you. Hopefully somehow we can get across. No. Anyway, I'm sure there's a much more um, visible walls everywhere. Are you there? Is this the guy we got to talk to? Into the shipyard. Oh, he flies up there. Okay, and we can clean the hole if we wish to. Clean the hole coal will cost 225. Okay, I just realised we didn't have enough money to do anything with the sails, so let's offload some of this stuff. And once I've offloaded all of the um, mission cargo, hopefully we'll get a bit more money and I'll get back to you. Okay, we've got nearly 2,000 gold now uh, after delivering all the missions. Let's pick up a bit of this meat because we are quite hungry and there's no food on board. And this meat's really good for hunger. I'll have a bit of drink and then we'll play around with the ships. What have we got mast wise? We've got a sail, we've got two masts, masts. I don't know which ones they are. Um, we've got a main mast looks like and a mizzen mast. We could get rid of these sails. That one. So we've got rid of a five yard at the back and a nine yard at the front. That's giving us some money. I guess for the materials. And the main, no, let's get to mast. Main mast one, main mast two. Okay, so those are two options there. Mizzen mast. Does this have none of it? Mizzen mast, no mizzen. Okay, so we can either have it or not have it. No lower force day. What is that? Well, we don't have a bit for it to connect on. We can't have that. What's this? No, we definitely can't have that. Oh, there we are. A bow sprite. So we could stick one of those things on if we wanted to. Bow sprite, no bow sprite. I mean, if we have that on, that looks kind of cool. It's 820 gold though. Can we have that one on? Single roof. Change the roof. Okay, we can. We have different, oh, no roof. Uh, the roof's not too bothersome. No supports. Hmm. We can get rid of the hammock. Or sails. Okay, so now we've got three sails. Now we've got this one as well. We can add the sail. The Dow jib. So that's the Dow jib. We can have the lantern. No, we can't have any lanterns. Junk. Okay, so we can have the Dow jib. We can have the cutter jib. It's more like a flag. Move that. What's the other ones look like? That's a jib too. Smaller one. Stay sails offer good upwind performance and can be used for pushing the boat backwards. I mean, that's probably the best one. It costs 12,007, but I think that would overlap. No, that's probably, we can't have that. I don't think it goes on the uh, the mast we've got. That one fits better. So there, that's that one, that's the one. And then, the thing is, I think that's gonna overlap with, I don't think we can have something here now, can we? Would that work? Okay, if it's red, so that's that's not good for that one now. Move that one. Let's try short gap. Oh, that seems to work. 
And then this one, we could try and have... Um, I mean, this is a crazy situation, isn't it? That looks like the old Doris cell. Let's go for that and just see, <laughs> see what uh, it's like. Okay. It would be nice to change the colours of the cells. Choose whatever colour cell we'd like. And you can get rid of the hammock and have a, have a bed in there if you wanted to. That's a good idea. What's happened to the Shimmer Tail? It's got three masts. Um, okay, I suppose we should do a short mission to see if we can actually get somewhere with these crazy amount of masts on. And this is just for fun, really. And I've spent a lot of money doing it, so it'd be nice to make some money back. Okay, it's the morning. Looks like it's going to be a beautiful morning. And I've decided to fill up the Shimmer Tail with goodies and mission stuff. So we can test out the new sounds properly and we're gonna head to our Ank Academy. We have got some heavy stuff actually, got some gems and I hope I haven't overloaded it. I decided not to bring the uh, the stove, we're just gonna bring the fishing rod and some hooks and about 20 uh, water in this barrel and let's head out. So onwards to a new adventure to try and make some money back that we're doing in this little experiment here. Let's take off the mooring ropes, if I can find it. A bit weird there, I'm not sure what's going on there. I don't know. I'm getting thirsty already. We're going to need to fish as soon as we get out there. Have we got a back rope on? There. There we go. Okay, so we need to head out. I'm not sure how we're going to get out there. Maybe what we'll do is we'll pull you backwards with this rope here. I'm not sure what the method envisions is that we're meant to be using here. Uh, that seemed to have worked. Seemed to have worked. Oh, off we go backwards. I don't even know what the sound is going to look like when they're down properly. But we're going backwards now without any sounds. Which is nice. Why is the wind blowing? Look at our look at the shimmer tail. We back out into the harbour. Bib bib bib. Um, the wind is blowing. Do you know what we don't have? We don't have a wind direction flag. Oh no, it's at the bottom. It's at the bottom. Okay, cool. So the wind is blowing to the right, so either one we want to keep drifting backwards. We're just going to back out the harbour the whole way, I think. That was a lot of momentum there. Alright, let's bring the front sail down. See what happens here. You're pulled in tight. Not you. I can pull you in tight as well. Get on there. Oh, this one's got two two pulleys. That's that's a that's a new one. That's a new one. All right, let you out. Oh, hang on. That is that is the angle. I am completely lost about how all these all work now. Which one lets it down? Okay, the ones on the mast, of course. Release one of the cells. Okay, it's that one. I didn't even know which one it was going to be. And that's actually turning us around. We are now doing... This is not, we're gonna go straight into the wall here. Let's go left. I wonder if we can go fast enough to catch the, catch the other side. Otherwise we're gonna go straight into the wall. Can we turn? Can we get through the wind here? Can't even see how this is working. It's very hard to imagine how the wind is pushing on this sail to make us turn around, but 
it seems to be working. It seems to be working so far. We can just get through this headwind. We, we're golden. We're golden. In fact, this is some good kind of turning here. It looks like we're just caught catching the other side of the wind any moment here. Oh, it's glorious. I'm liking this front little cell thing. Bow sprite cell. Awesome. Oh, I reckon this is going to be... This, this is a good combination so far. We've only tried one of them, but... The others are just as good as this. It's going to be brilliant. Right, let's straighten her up. Straighten her up. Let's go to the right bit. Make sure we're not going all the way around. We are going all the way around. Uh, do what? No, stop, stop, stop. You come up. You pull up. I don't want you anymore. You're making it worse than it was. <laughs> okay. You're just for turning. Right, um... The other one. How about you? Stop you. What the heck is going on there? Um... I don't know what's going on there. Can we, can we go right a bit? Is it meant to look like that? Let's go into one. got caught up in other stuff. Threaten you up. Getting hungry. We need to be out there catching a fish. Or we'll starve to death. We need to avoid the sandbanks. Once we get past the sandbank, we're gonna um, release the back cell and it should be safe to do so. Got a bit of weight to us, but I don't think we're going to be too low in the water to hit that sandbank. I think we're going to be okay. Goodbye, God Rock City! We'll see you again soon, hopefully, if I learn to navigate the high seas on this little vessel. Avoid that. Do you know what? Let's go right to the tads because. Don't trust it. Now straighten you up. Shaft a tad just to get past that bit of uh, sandiness. That's good, that's good. Hard the port. Awesome. Awesome. Lovely, lovely. Straighten up, straighten up, straighten up. Where's the wind blowing now? Seems to be laughing a bit. Can't really tell. Right, let's that back one. I think we can let you down now, and then let you out on one side. I don't know. How about we let you out on both sides? Oh, that's the other one. Hang on. I meant this one, but... There we go. I think that's good. I'm not sure why it's a funny shape. But that's okay. <laughs> um, let's let you down. And where's your one there? Let's let you out as well. Full speed ahead. Marvellous. Right, let, while we're going in the direction of this wind behind us, one one thing I did bring with us, look, we're going, seems to be going quite fast, but let's test it. Let's test the speed here. This is the moment of truth. We're going. Let's have a six knots. <laughs> six and a half knots. It seems faster. Because it's so low down, but you know, uh, is what it is. But it's glorious. Off we go. Glorious. And we want to go. I didn't bring any maps with us, but I think we want to go north. 
west. Let's get going northwest as soon as possible. Fortunately, I didn't bring the map with us. I should have really. Um, how much can a map weigh? A map is only made of paper. Probably doesn't weigh much. Oh crap, that's too much. Land. This one here probably can be pulled in. I'd imagine that can be pulled in a bit. Like so. But it's hard to know. I don't want to go left a bit. Feeling those sails in did seem to turn the ship a bit. Train up, train up. Just to the right of the land would be great. About there. That's good. A quick test. Anything changed? Then we're gonna have to start fishing. Okay, we're doing about five, six knots, almost six knots. Okay, time to catch some fish. So we are hungry. We're not going to survive if we don't catch something. This is imperative. Imperative. Just having a sip of my tea and we caught a fish. Oh, hooked a fish. It's a shimmer towel. This is a good omen. And a tune though, it should be a little bit safe now. But, um, kept the hook, which is good. Put you there. But I'm going to need to eat both of them probably right now because we're right on the edge of hunger. Let's go for the shimmer towel. When you cook these you normally get quite a lot back but we don't have a stove so we're going to have to eat it raw. Not the most thrilling. Yeah, it's going to be a tough mission of catching fish. Are we going... We're still, we've gone too much to the north here. Keep going northwest. If we're gonna to get to our destination. I don't know. Didn't bring the map, don't know exactly where we're going, as in the direction. From memory it is northwest ish. Probably should have bought bought a map. Okay, the wind is everything should be tight I reckon. Let's bring this in tight. Has that changed the direction? How about the back one? Bring you in tight. Tight to the Twiger. Okay, we're leaning. People were telling me you shouldn't be leaning. Probably should let something out a bit so we don't lean so much. Maybe, maybe we'll take the advice. Let's let it out a bit and see what happens. There we go, a bit less leaning. Okay, let's do that again. Just so we don't lean. Okay, let's see what happens to the front one if we pull this in. Pull this one in tight. Okay, 
I quite like I quite like the cell configuration. I think it's quite good. I quite like that front bow sprite cell. Great. I think everything's coming up quite well. Do you know what we should do though? We shouldn't rest in our laurels. We need to keep um, keep fishing. But I have not seen the Shimmertail looking much happier than she is right now. I think she's really enjoying her new look. She really liked being pampered. She liked having the money spent on her. She's a good girl. She deserves a little treat. A nice little visit. Maybe one day we'll do the same for Doris. Let me know guys in the comments what your favourite shimmer towel or any kind of ship sail configuration is or would be. And any suggestions? Um, maybe not for this one. Well, yeah, what I should have done for this one. and But not suggestions for this one because I've already done it now. Too late. But um, we will eventually get back to Doris, the Dow, And I wonder what we can put on her. But the next mission, once we've got to our Anki Academy and back to Goldwater City, is going to be heading north on the next third Grand Voyage. All the way to a new region, going further north than, we, than we've ever been before. That will be an experience. Something I've actually been looking forward to. So I'm actually quite excited about that one. I can't wait. And it's a Shimmer Tail! Oh, glorious Shimmer Tail! I just realized a glorious Shimmer Tail ate our hook, so uh, yeah, we're gonna have to put another hook on it. But that's okay. Well, let's eat this Shimmer Tail actually, just so we uh, can survive a bit longer. When you don't have a stove, it's a constant fight for survival with the hunger. I only bought six hooks, so hopefully that's enough. Um, it does seem to be a bit blowy to the right now. We do seem to be a bit... ...leany. It's going on the wind, so the wind is... Probably to the right here. Not quite sure what to do here. Let's put the gems on this side for starters. Well, I mean, worst case, we'll let the sound out if we get stuck. But hang on, are we going the right direction, first of all? Northwest, pretty much good. Let's go a bit more to the west. Do a bit more. Because. The direction does affect quite a lot of things. Uh, let you out a bit. Tad more. The back one, you can go out a bit more. That way. This one is a very front one. You can go out a bit more. You need a little drink. Oh, did I not fill up? Oh dear, okay. Fill up. And put you there. And now it's night time, so we should probably get some sleep. And I'll see you guys in the morning. Good night, everybody. Okay, this. Oh dear. Bit of water there in the board. Um. There's Skullrock City behind us. How far north have we gone? It seems really far behind us, like we've gone really far. Oh, there's some island there. I've got a feeling that's it, you know. I've got a feeling that's it. I, f I don't know what it looks like anymore. I've got a feeling that is it there. I can't see any island to the right of us. 
And I think in the absence of an island to the right, we're going to have to go to that one. I've gone past it before. Let's go left. Hard to port. And then we're really going to have to start getting some food because we are on the edge of starvation. Straighten up, straighten up. Okay, how's the wind looking? Wind is directly almost into the wind here. Everything pulling in tight. Everything go as tight as you can go. Which is not great because we're going to get stuck in the wind if we do that. Let's get to go to the right a bit more. Go to the right a bit just so we can get out of being stuck. Then straighten up. Every, every, everything pull in. They're all in tight. Right, priority though is food. Food is the priority here. Not starving to death is often the priority. But I think that's it. It's got to be it. In the absence of a better plan, that's where we're going. But thank you, my friends, for all the people who subscribe. We have got over 500 subscribers now. You guys are glorious, lovely people. And a lot of you have been clicking the like button. Thank you very much. It really does mean a lot to me. Oh, and we've caught another fish. It's a shimmer towel. Yum, delicious. We do need some more food though because uh, that wasn't quite enough. Satiate us and then we'll turn to port and get towards further in towards that um, the island which hopefully is our academy. It may not be though. But let's turn towards it now. And then we'll carry on fishing. Uh, let's quickly have a drink. Jump over here. Fill this up. How much is left in there? Six. Only one more bottle in there. It's better be the place. Should be through the wind and out the other side and able to go straight towards those islands. Which hopefully is the academy. And let's straighten her up, which is good. And a bit more left actually. We may not even have time to catch another fish before we get there. Depending on how it goes. Look at the shimmer towel. Looking very beautiful right now. As she takes a bit of water. Uh, let's let this out so that we can uh, actually that's not going to work is it the wind's coming from the front pull it in back in we'll just move the gems over to the, the right hand side shifting weight on a, on a racing sailboat is a thing that people do it's a legitimate thing I think People stand on one side, even. And that, that's the heavy stuff, anyway. What are they? Are you all heavy? You are also heavy. It's fine. Everything's good. As long as it's not taking on water, we are okay. Go for another quick fish if we can. 
and then my the view. Yeah, that's that is the academy. I think I remember that's what it looks like. We're actually not that far away by the looks of things. That's a shimmer tower. Races the walls. Even though the wind's coming from the front of it, we race towards our Ang Academy to deliver those gems that I need so much in the scholarly institution. We got another one of the same type. Have we? Am I gonna say it again? No, it's not. It's a salmon, is it? No, it's not a salmon. Do you know what it is? It's a shimmer town. Delicious. Oh, crap. I didn't bring the telescopes. But that's okay. Okay, so we are coming up to it quite fast. I quite like, I do quite like these sounds, I don't know. They're, they're a bit cumbersome, there's three of them. I'm not quite sure how to expertly, now, you know, navigate myself around all of them, but we're managing. Is there something down? There's a fish down there, it's a cooked fish. There's a cooked fish. Can we save for later? It's still good. Because I haven't implemented fish going bad. What a glorious find. This day is a lucky day. Beautiful. What a beautiful thing to behold. Those people in that institution are going, what the heck is that? What type of ship is that? And what sound configuration are they going for? I've never seen anything like it in my, all my scholarly years. Well, now you have. Stick it in your textbooks. Because here I come. It's Pothos on the Shimmer Tower. Okay, so we're going to have to raise... Probably should raise this one. So that we can... Uh, come in with a bit more grace than otherwise we might. There's, there we are, that will slow us down a bit. Uh, the very front one we probably don't need, so let's bring that one in. Because I don't know how that's going to affect things. It seems a bit... helps us, makes us turn a bit more than we otherwise might. So now we've got down to one cell. Which is good. No, completely the opposite wind that we want, honestly. Because we would be going straight into the wind. We're going to have to do a, what, a U turn. We're going to have to do a U turn here. If we went straight there, I think. Or at least go out in a, in a bit. Yeah, because we don't want to get stuck in the wind. Pull you tight. So we can get the most out of you for now. Beautiful, I think, is. I mean, we're in no rush. We're in no rush. Come in gracefully. Do it properly. It's not a high octane kind of experience. This is a peaceful experience. This is a game where we enjoy time alone at sea. This is us and the environment. This is us, the wooden ship, the sails, the wind, the sea, in our hair, the salt. Well, yeah, all the, all the things. All the things. Right, so we can probably turn right now and we'll be good. I don't think we have to do the whole U-turn. I think we're going to be good. We'll go hard to the starboard. It probably would be better if we did the U-turn, but... It would take longer. Despite what I've just been saying. We're going to go to the right and then hard left. This is good. This is good. Enough momentum that when we do turn the pull, it will help slow us down. In fact, if we aim a bit more to the left, 
that when we turn, we kind of slow down just as we're reaching the jetty. The plan. In we come. Beautiful place. Well, I've just got a good feeling about this. I do enjoy this game. It's such a relaxing game. It's such a kind of uh, about adventure. It's about exploration. It's about uh, survival. Just like living off the sea. It's got trading elements. It's brilliant. It's a great game. Great little game. Do put down any suggestions you want to see for other games though on this channel. I read all the comments. Right, Potters, grab that wheel because we're going to be going hard to pull about now actually. Here we come, here we come. We're, going, we're turning quite fast there. Straighten up, straighten up. And grab the wheel again. And almost let go. Left a bit. Okay, um, this may be, we may be stopping a bit short here. Maybe stopping a bit short here. Oh dear. Should have done the whole U-turn thing. Can we drift in without getting wet? We don't get wet. It's a good it's a good landing. No, it's happening. It's happening. I'm not even gonna have to cheat here. This is this is perfect. This is perfect. This kind of speed is the sort of speed that, you know, big vessels actually arrive in just like really slowly. But we've done it. In my books, that's a good um That is a legitimate good professional landing. Jump over here. Grab this back one over here. Put it on the back. Brilliant. We've done it. Marvellous. Docked on the shimmer towel. Docked on the jetty with the shimmer towel. With its new, the new cells. Let's bring the cell up just to finish things off. Brilliant. Well... Let's end it here. We'll have a couple of short episodes. We'll have this short episode and we'll do, I'll do another one, a short episode on the way back. And then we'll start on the long voyage of long voyages. And, and these guys behind me are here to greet us. He looks a bit fed up with his life and he looks even more fed up with his life. But as always, I've been Pothos. You have been awesome. This has been a shimmer tower of lovely different sounds. Goodbye. Don't forget to subscribe.